Welcome back to another episode of Apple Arcade Gaming. This is part two um, of Life Slide. We've had some issues with the audio. I've, I've actually done a, a bit of a playthrough and we've had a few upgrades on our paper plane. But um, yeah, we'll get back into it now. We've managed to sort it. We've turned down the master volume for anyone else that's planning on doing anything like this. Um, yeah, this is on iOS, so it's so much nicer to play as you'll be able to see. So in terms of like movement, we now have like full control. We can be smooth with it. Um, whereas if you were playing it beforehand with the buttons, you'd kind of lose that sensitivity. So hopefully now we can get a good, uh, good playthrough. But yeah, uh, I've learned a few things since the first episode so when you do pick up things like these hearts um, if you don't need them you don't have to use them you can kind of keep them uh, floating about uh, obviously the blue sections are for your upgrade points but if you were to damage yourself you can tap the screen use your points there and uh, you can either tap the screen use your health build your health back up or you can not use it and it will give you extra bonus points so for instance like this we're not going to use it uh, we've got 42 reading at the minute for our points that we've collected then we get a little bit more um, one of the oh dear we've already lost a load of uh, a load of speed yeah i was noticing that with as an issue with this where you you play it and possibly just because you're using um, iOS and you've got like a bit of natural tilt into it anyway you would drop off quite a a bit probably doesn't make any sense anyway um, yeah we'll get back into it so we've got as you can see there quite a lot of upgrades so yeah what I was finding was you'd lose a lot of speed just naturally through tilting it maybe incorrectly but there is a, a certain way to play this game it seems hopefully you can hear me nice and clearly now as well because beforehand I definitely wasn't coming across also hopefully I don't sound too nasally so there you go you could see it like pitching up its nose which I wasn't particularly trying to do Yeah, hopefully you've been enjoying um, Apple Arcade Gaming in general so far. Let's get a bit of speed going. Again, it seems quite easy to lose that speed. Um, integrity of your plane is really, really important too. So sometimes it's more important than actually having... Oh dear, well, let's see if we can bank off and... You see, you just lose a lot of momentum. So, it's quite a difficult game to play that way, in that it doesn't always do what you want it to do. We actually almost made it to the next stage of, of life, which I can't remember what it's called now. Childhood, I think. So yeah, we, we're kind of losing quite a lot of, of speed. And then that happens. So I've I've not learnt yet how to pick up like what wind that you need to see and whatnot. So I'm not always great at it. However, you can't just rest on your laurels. Maybe you do just need to fly a little bit higher sometimes and then bring her down. But again, there's so much in this game to to really pick up and learn which is great but yeah it is complex at times as well despite looking you know like a, a fairly simple game to play there's a lot to it right so we're almost at the next stage now I remember seeing all these um, green pieces Let's see if we get a bit of speed
Okay, so I can't entirely remember what plane parts do. So if you don't tap the screen, you don't actually get your bonus. So you can go past these things. I was going past some green ones earlier. And again, I didn't entirely know what I was doing. So sometimes it's worth just watching some of these just so you can figure them out. But yeah, what would be really nice is just to have like a, an idea as to where you're getting your wind from, um, how to keep your speed up. Also, you gotta watch out for trees. <laughs> So I've crashed into those before, uh, they leave a nasty mark. Okay, that's quite a nice one. I mean, it lets you get away with quite a lot, so if you accidentally just skim across the ground, it won't really um, mess you up. Right, so these were the uh, green sections that were going on. We're going to go on to a lake. So if we use them, you see now that's why I ran out. So you need to utilize all of these. Which I wasn't doing before. So that's quite cool with all of the different birds and whatnot there. So you can probably see I'm not particularly great at this game. Uh, my first playthrough was much, much better than this. Much, much better. Yeah, that wasn't great. However, we can get a new part on it. Um, I'm thinking maneuverability sounds pretty good. Yeah, we'll see if we can make it to the next stage, which is a, a really cool, cool part. So just these little bits here, they're just like boosts to uh, get you to your next stages, which I wasn't using before. And so you can imagine the amount of like speed that you slowly lose. So even they pick them up. If you're not using them, you're kind of just wasting them. Kind of in a way, the more you know. Yeah, that's much better. Get those boosts. Because this seems quite flat. So it seems like those green sections are sort of like your turbulent air. But at the same time, be careful of where you're going. Um, last time I stuck quite close to the river. And I did quite well off of that. Also, you'll notice this is really manoeuvrable now. Right, my integrity is going. This is where I failed last time, is that my integrity kept on dropping off. And so I just didn't make it. Just like that. Hopefully I've got a slight checkpoint between there. Yeah, it is quite difficult. And if you don't keep on top of your integrity, especially during this part, you really like to lose out. Which you know you can you can do without getting extra upgrades quite a bit they're not super important but you need to make sure your integrity is just upstanding and doesn't drop off the cliff it's, it's as important as your health which is why it's obviously there
Right. Yeah, just try and keep on top of them. Make sure that you're getting as many pickups as you can. It's important to make sure that you're keeping an eye out on like where you're going. Okay, last time, just let down by losing all of my integrity. Hopefully this. Isn't like a, no way. That's a shame. Like you're not actually able to turn back on things like this either. Right then, given how difficult this is, I'm going to leave this here. Hopefully you've enjoyed the playthrough so far. Let's see what these do. Okay, see you. Interesting. What a nice breeze as well. Right, hopefully you've enjoyed it. If you have, uh, leave a leave a like, subscribe, and keep an eye out for, for more episodes. If you tap the bell, then you'll be updated as to when I do um, upload. I'm also planning to play more Overland as well as Spaceland so hopefully you've, uh, you've enjoyed it. Take care for now. Bye.